Jesus invites us to come and follow so that we may go and learn the good news. Each of us is an innkeeper who decides if there's room for Jesus. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. This is the third week of the Advent season. We have met Mary and Joseph and learned how they opened their hearts to Jesus, being his parents on earth. Today we will meet another person who also lived during the time of Jesus' birth. I am the innkeeper. Let me tell you the most amazing story. More than 2,000 years ago, I lived in Bethlehem. The land was all part of the Roman Empire. The Roman Emperor Augustus wanted to have a list of all the people in the empire to make sure they paid their taxes. He ordered everyone to return to the town from where their families originally came and enter their names in a register or census there. With this order, the town of Bethlehem began to fill up more with more and more families who came to register for the census. There was a couple arrived one night looking for a place to stay. Their names were Mary and Joseph. When they reached Bethlehem, they had problems finding somewhere to stay. So many people had come to register for the census that every house was full and every bed was taken in all of the guest rooms. They knocked on my door. They told me they had traveled a long way from Nazareth to Bethlehem to register. Joseph and Mary traveled very slowly because Mary's baby was due to be born soon. I told them that the inn was full. There was no place left for them to stay. I said no to Jesus. They were very tired and didn't know what to do. They found the only place, a stable with animals. In our time, we often kept animals in the house, especially at night and used them like central heating. Families normally slept on the upper floor with the animals below to give them extra warmth. So in this place, that stable, Mary and Joseph stayed the night among the animals sleeping. Like me, you have the opportunity to open your heart to Jesus. Will you say yes? Today we light two purple candles and one pink candle on our Advent wreath to symbolize the third week of Advent. Innkeeper had no place for Mary and jo Joseph to stay. Instead, they found only a stable with the animals in which to spend the night, a place where it would be warm with fresh straw upon which they could rest. Help us, Lord, to be joyful in the coming of Jesus and to prepare our hearts to give him a warm welcome during the season of Advent and always. Oh, Jesus, help us get our hearts ready for you. Help us to come and follow. Dear God, all around us, people are getting ready for Christmas. You have called us to come and follow you, to go and live the good news. We are filled with joy as we eagerly wait for the coming of your Son, Jesus. May we be like the innkeeper and say yes. 